for months, maybe even a full year, I've come out here and my real name is Joe and I've been living with leukemia for 11 years because after I'm done whooping leukemia's ass once again, I'm coming back home because I will beat this and I will be back so you will see me very, very soon. I'm going to say this a lot, but I'm going to start off by saying thank you. I missed y'all. Serious, I missed y'all. There is no other job like this. There's no other fan base like you guys. I'm ad living a little bit here, but I used to say this was my yard, but this is our yard. I've always believed in God. I've always believed that he's favored me and looked out for me, but I was scared. I was insecure, and I didn't really know if I wanted to share that secret with the world. I was scared to tell everybody because I didn't know how you would react. Overwhelming and God sent. Thank you so much. That was the magnitude. That is how strong it was to be surrounded by y'all's love and y'all's grace. The only thing that is important that I have the ability to step foot in this ring every single night. And I'm going to use it to support those who are in need just like I was. Well, we advertise it as an update, so should we get to the update? Yeah. When, I named, when I made my announcement, I said that I was going to swing for the fences. We did better than that, y'all. We didn't just swing for the fences, man. We hit a home run. So when I tell you this, I am so grateful, I'm so humbled, and I'm so honored. We'll get, we'll get to that later. We'll get to that later, yeah. The good news is I'm in remission, y'all. So with that being said, the big dog is back! And just one last time. Thank you so much, y'all. I love y'all. And we echo the sentiments of the WWE Universe. on what Corey is a night 
of celebration. Celebration. What an emotional moment here tonight live in Atlanta, Georgia. Big Dog is back. Battling leukemia back in October. Uh, I wasn't sure more happy that Roman Reigns is back than we here at the WWE. His family through all of this alongside her son in the WWE Universe. Burn it down! This feels good. Welcome back to the big dog. Black made his WWE. Mr. Damn, Alistair Black wasting no time here in WWE. Make and his tag team partner from Paducah, Kentucky, weighing blown by otherworldly athleticism. Then in Wilder, the revival. Oh. And the revival wasting little time. Going up. Revival looking for redemption. Oh. Uh. He takes to the air, and there's a takes out Wilder. Guys, this match hasn't get... even officially started the bell. Black and wow. Lighting. I can't blame the Revival for one. Whoa. Oh, it's their Black. Beware of the striking abilities. And it Boom. Boom. By... They're on a whole other level and aerial maneuvers on top of that. And there's the that. cover by Black. Hooks the legs and I got in a rematch because remember, no more automatic rematch clause broke. Oh. Revival looking for the double team. Pulls through. Black on his shoulders now. Almost. To a striking match with Alex. Oh. Again, yeah, his foot on the moves. bottom rope, cover yet again, and a near fall for the... And there's Ricochet, Whoa. Wilder set off. Well, here you go, together. Ricochet! Boom! Oh. Black! Black and Ricochet have beat... And Alistair Black! The names of Ricochet and Alistair Black. What a stuck in the action, Ricochet moves off, off the air. Nailed it, the Black Mac beat champions on Monday Night Raw. When you were the acting general manager, you made light of Roman Reigns' fight with leukemia. You told the WWE Universe that they should just move on, and you also said that you hoped Roman would never come back to Raw. So, are you at all concerned what's going to happen when you do see Roman next? But it was an emotional night for everybody. Plus, I was under the stress of being acting general manager Monday Night Raw, as well as being an active competitor. I'll just say this, for Roman's sake, I hope our paths don't cross. My main man, Slick Ric Flair. You turning what today? 17 or is that 70? 70 years old? Happy birthday, Ric Flair. Woo! From your dog, Snoop Dogg. Enjoy your day, big homie. Love you, boy. Love you more today than I did yesterday. Ric Flair, baby. Wait just a second. The lady of WWE. What a class act. Lady. Well, Lacey Evans, of course, among the NXT superstars who are here. This is a woman that's got it all, full package. <laughs> and more greatness. Played a song all night. You should learn by now. All this celebrating tonight has got me in a festive mood. Only this time, is everybody listening? I want to know this qualification match. I like this. You trying to uh, play me off the stage like this is the Academy Awards or something? Because you came out here and you interrupted me and I was about to sing a song about how much I love Atlanta. <laughs> Winning it, now that's an entirely different story. <laughs> I want to do right Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, spring of the devil, dirt! As Dean Ambrose has challenged Drew McIntyre to a no disqualification man that easily. Elias, down. Well, coming up next, the Raw Women's Champion, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. Natalia! Natalia is... Who's this woman? Rowdy Ronda Rousey! And Rousey and Natalia face-to-face -face in the middle of the ring. But look who showed up. So Natalia will start things off against Sarah Logan. Oh, the right technique. But the brutality is unparalleled. Look at this. The end of Monday Night Raw with Ronda Rousey. Natalia had to avoid the riots. Who twice battle Rousey. World talking about 
Roman Reigns. You uh -oh. kick off that story as the night unfolds, but meanwhile, Ronda Rouse. Oh, oh say that oh, again, that's Renee. A Take a look at this. Yeah. Boom! Standing S squad. Ronda flattens Ruby Riot. In a heart. Oh! Well, Jan, you're spot.